Hello there, this is the Bookkeeper Master on YouTube. Welcome to this video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to delete transactions on QuickBooks Online. This is delete individual transactions, not delete the whole software and start afresh. I'm going to show you how to delete specific transactions. Now, the thing that I really like about QuickBooks Online is it's very user-friendly and I think it's very simple to use and know what to do. The way you delete a transaction is simply by finding the transaction and then there's usually a delete option once you have found the transaction. And let me demonstrate this. So if we have an invoice, say if I go to the sales ledger, so invoices and customers, if I click on the customer account, let's say this invoice here, I wish to delete. I raised it in error, it hasn't been sent to the customer, so I don't need to raise a credit note. I just need to delete it off the system. All you need to do is click on the invoice. The invoice template will appear. If you go down to more, then there's a delete option here. Just click delete and then confirm you want to delete it and the invoice will be taken off the system. Now, I strongly suggest that you don't delete any transactions where you have reconciled the bank accounts, they're reconciled transactions. Don't delete any transactions you've already accounted VAT for. But let me demonstrate some more transactions to delete. So let's say this time it's a supplier invoice. If you find the supplier, find the invoice that you wish to delete, click on it, just go to more, click delete, and then confirm that you want to delete that invoice. And then it'll just be taken off the system and won't be visible anymore. Other transactions that need deleting, if you go to the chart of accounts, so down the bottom here we have accounting, chart of accounts, you can find your transaction in the chart of accounts. If you just bring up or open one of these nominal accounts by double clicking or by clicking account history. So we have HSBC current account, if I just double click on that, I'm taken to the account. You can see all the transactions booked on that account. If you want to delete one of these transactions, if you found the transaction you want to delete, just click on it and then click delete. So it's all about finding the transaction. Once you've found the transaction, there's usually a delete option next to the transaction. With invoices, it's usually under more. With expenses and transactions between nominal accounts, you can only just find the transaction and there's a delete button. There's also options to edit next to the delete. I hope that this has helped. I have plenty more QuickBooks online videos on my website, freebookkeepingaccounting.com. If you're really stuck, I do offer email support for £35 a year, which includes answering any questions you have about QuickBooks Online and providing support by email. Details about that are on my website, www.freebookkeepingaccounting.com.